work not only in these walls, but also in Vesta Elementary, also in Emily Fires D, but also in the Carlisle Apartments, also at Forum Park, also with the land, or that the, the neighborhood we call on particularly, this is at between 59 and the Bellway, where we have said, Jesus reigns here. Christ is risen from a triumphant Palm Sunday to a dark Friday, passing through sorrow, through death, to life and joy. We arrive at Resurrection Sunday. By the power of God, the cross did not defeat Christ. The tomb could not be. Christ is risen, carried forward God's healing, carried to a world where truth and justice triumph over evil and oppression. You have been called out of death and into new life. Rejoice, life first through death. Jesus Christ is alive forevermore. Amen. He is risen. He is risen indeed. My life to Christ is literally best decision of my life. Uh, Jesus getting on the cross for my sins is the biggest gift I could have ever received. Although I can never repay him, I strive to be a good and faithful servant, and I'm thankful that the West allows me to do that. And uh, Pastor Ayo, I thank you for being a vessel and creating a community of family and genuine Christians. So um, I kind of fast forwarded through my story a little bit. We skimmed through some, some stories that, you know, if you want to know me, you can ask me, but that's kind of my testimony. Uh, just God is so amazing and He just saved me. So I mean I can't I can I can only put it raw. I can't really sugarcoat it. <laughs> so yeah, thank you. But let me share my testimony.
I know that I have a renewed life. I have a renewed mind. I have a renewed, you know, every part of me is just renewed because why he has, he has resurrected today. And now can call, I can be called his child and he can be called my girl. So. Be able to um, dwell with family and friends, be able to connect with people who I may not have talked to before. Um, and just overall, just celebrating the death um, and life of Jesus. When Christ is risen, we no longer have to live in darkness. We now have a new life in Jesus. And so it's definitely a day to celebrate. And not just today, but every day that we have that new life.